I remember moments from childhood where someone who was really good at preparing a meal Mm. and they just thought about like the smallest thing. If someone in the group had an allergy and they went out of their way to create a whole separate thing for that person. I think that's the same as picking up rocks. I think the person who sends emails and they backspace a few words because they're like, oh, I, I think that might come across the way and I want to be sensitive to this person. And they think about that and they change that up. I think that's the same thing as going outside and looking at the sky. I think the people who are listening, they can hear tone and voice. And I'm conscious of this because I'm being autistic. I cannot hear tone and voice very well. And there are people who can tell by the slightest shift in tone that something has changed in that person. And they're going to be the one who's able to ask in a way that I can't about how are you really doing and help that person find peace. Mm. So I think there's a lot, like as many as there are stars in the sky, like the, there's so many different ways that like we are accessing that and we can nurture that. 